Welcome to the opening fixture of this season's UEFA Europa League. The domestic season still relatively freshly started in many of Europe's major leagues. It is a time filled with hope and expectation, and that is certainly the case here. The first step, one of many, towards the very summit of European football. This is the time when you dream, indeed perhaps you believe, you are allowed to believe. Old Trafford rising to the occasion as only Old Trafford can. Some terrific scenes at the Stratford end. ready for another edition of this tournament I think we are well what are we waiting for Peter let's get the show on the road this competition brings a special sense of occasion because of its history and tradition and I guess we feel privileged to have worked on it over the years and remembering some of the the great moments and I sincerely hope we're in for uh, more starting right now There's the whistle. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Paul Pogba. He could be a real game changer for this team, Peter. He's got the strength to hold off defenders and the technical ability to pick out a killer pass. He can also shoot with great power and accuracy. He's a real midfield dynamo, actually, capable of, of winning. Checo hits it! And out to safety. Cleared away. Roma have it back and they can go again. Pellegrini goes up and over. Pogba. One Bissaka. Roma playing high up the pitch here, very much taking the front foot approach. Fazio does well to read it and intercepts. Rashford plays it out to the wing. Shaw. Clears it out of harm's way. Greenwood. Rashford. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Rashford unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Pellegrini. Lindelof. Manchester United, and they've been caught out here. And through to the goalkeeper. And it's Dzeko. Defenders on the... It's Dzeko! Same again, same outcome. Roma really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Rashford with the clearance. Perez. 
Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Cavani pings it out wide. It's got through to him. Now it's Cavani. Cavani. Smalling can get it clear. Greenwood. Lovely bit of skill. So who's he picking out? Fernandez shoots! Perez. Pastore. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Rashford. Forward it goes. Greenwood pushes to get on the end of it. And it's Perez. Pastore. And he's there to cut it out. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. There too. And here's Mkhitaryan. And here's Dzeko. Roma have a free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. And he's going direct. Matic gets it away. There will be one more at a time. Pellegrini. Pellegrini not easily shrugged off. He's gone for it! It's there! Well, players of his stature just live for moments like that. Another really important contribution as we near half-time, and it can make such an impact on each mindset. That was glorious. Pinpoint accuracy. You know, what was notable in that, Peter, was the fact that he didn't try to blast it. He chose placement instead and delivered a peach. Roma, draw for... And the half-time whistle goes. Well, there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. And the second half gets on the way. Manchester United don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. One Bissaka. Lindelof. Juan Bissaka tries to get it forward quickly. Mukatarian. Perez.
Pellegrini. And it's Pastore. Vertu. Vertu with the crossfield ball. Roma making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front. And this is something different. Has he found his man? Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Cavani. And the shot! He's pulled off a fine save. Cavani simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. The attendance for this match was 70,900. Pellegrini, who does have an assist to his name. Lindelof. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Chance to cross here. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Pellegrini. Hoist it forward. Bruno Fernandes. Lindelof. Matic. Pogba. And it's played forward. Fazio gets into the right position to intercept. One Bissaka. James. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. And that's been levered clear. And here's Rashford. Hoists it high. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. One Bissaka. One Bissaka goes looking. Bruno Fernand goes for goal! Good clearance and very necessary. Manchester United are looking desperate here. Short on time and options. Uh, Cavani! It's in! They have grabbed themselves an equaliser! Even some of the opposing fans are clapping that. You just have to appreciate it. Well, the ball flight may be unpredictable, but the predictable part was the technique. It screamed goal all the way. After 83 minutes, it is number seven, Edison Cavani. Time for a change in personnel. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Manchester United grabbed the equaliser, and we're all square. Manchester United surely know by now that they've put so much work into producing the equaliser that they'll battle on for a winner. You know, it's, it's all one-way traffic for them now, and they simply have to capitalise on it. Final seconds, this has to be it. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. There will be one more at a time. Lindelof. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Not ideal, but not the worst start at all. It's an opening day draw. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? It could have been both better or worse, so a draw will be a happy compromise, I think, to open their group account.
it always helps to have something to build on and I think this will do nicely.